Well, hello everyone. Thank you for clicking on this video. My name is Chance and we're gonna tour this brand new two-story modular home right here. Now, I gotta talk about a few things on this exterior and we're gonna head on in, but let me say, I'll always have more information in the description if you wanna check that out. But what I like about this one, just by taking a quick peek before I started recording, is the fact that it is two-story. However, the size is really nice on this one. It's not like overly large, which I know a lot of y'all like to look at those and I, don't get me wrong, I like to tour them as well. But I'm saying for those of you that need something, you know, you don't need 3000 plus square foot, but you would like to have that second level. This may be the home for you. So sit back, relax, let's get right into it. I'm gonna be very brief on the exterior. Where am I at? Is probably what you're wondering. I'm glad you asked. I am at Middletown Homes here. This is, this is at their Fairmont location in uh, Fairmont, West Virginia. I told you I was coming this direction and I'm excited because I'm, I'm gonna get some awesome homes while I'm up here. Uh, they got several different locations. I'm gonna go to all of them, check them out. Y'all be sure to stay tuned to the channel. If you wanna see more of the homes, don't forget to subscribe to the notification bell. And as always, drop us a like. Come up here and get a close up of the vinyl. You know, when you order these homes, customization and all that, can be done on pretty much everything in the house. Y'all do know this is a show model. Basically, we we'll order off of this one. That's why when we go back here, you're not gonna see the brick or anything like that. But I do wanna show you, we have a side door here off the side, and then one thing on the back we're gonna head in. So yeah, we have that door there. And then also back here on the back, if the, the, ah, the sun, I feel like it's always working against me. Sliding glass door. But yeah, keep in mind, all this will be bricked up, whatever you want to do. Let's head around the front, head into this beautiful home. Here we go. They got this one named the Kate's Cap. Maybe they named it after my wife, Caitlin. <laughs> I'm sure you're watching, Caitlin, maybe, I, I think. <laughs> Are y'all ready to head into this wonderful modular home? Let's go. So as soon as you walk in, you see the stairs right there, but we're gonna hold off on all that. And uh, we'll get to that in a minute. Right now, I wanna focus on this living room, kitchen and everything that we've got going on. Went with a carpet here in your living room. Just keep in mind, as always, customization and stuff can take place on all of that. More looking at the floor plan is what we're going to be focusing on. And I'm telling you, I know I've already mentioned it, but one thing I really like about this one is just uh, the the compactness of it, I guess, if, that's, if that makes any sense. Wow, I love that light fixture in the kitchen. But, like, from the exterior, you're like, man, this is a big house. And then as you walk inside, you notice that, like, hey, this is, this is actually very cozy, comfortable looking. Because, you know, at the end of the day, the bigger the house you got, the more you got to clean. Can I, can I get an amen? All right. So this is the dining area. And there's something really special around there, but we're going to hold off on that. But I will give you a little glimpse of it. Wow, it's a really nice barn door. Make sure I give you a full shot of that. There is those sliding doors that we looked at on the exterior. And we flow over into the kitchen. And yeah, I know I mentioned this uh, light fixture, but that looks really good. And look at these countertops on this island. We gotta take a quick second to check out this sink that we have right here. Obviously, you gotta have the window right here that you can look out as you're uh, doing dishes, or if you don't wanna do your dishes, Whirlpool's got you right here. This thing right here has a five year, no, I'm just kidding. I don't know much about Whirlpool appliances, can't promote them. But I do like the colors. Is it, it's kind of, I think maybe it's that, they call it gun metal, maybe. I think is, is, what, is what some of the manufacturers call these appliances, but they look really good. Shot into there, the backsplash. 
goes very well with the rest of the design of this house. Now, let's see, did I show you? We've got cabinets here on this side of the island. And, and for this kitchen, man, this is a really nice sized island. I'm curious what's behind this door. Is it a paint? <laughs> it is a storage closet. Which obviously, you know, they got a lot of decor and stuff in there, but man, that'd be really nice to store a lot of important things there. It's right here off your kitchen. So now let's go in here and check out these bedrooms. Then I'm gonna come back and show you the interesting stuff that we have over there. I mean, on the other end. The trim, the baseboards look really nice in this home. As we come from the living room, the first thing that we're gonna see right here is our guest bath or our second bath, which will be the first bath of the tour. We've got us a uh, nice round porcelain sink. Wow, I like these light fixtures in here as well. Got a, got a different flooring that we have. Uh, it's gonna be the same type of flooring, just different color. And that's another thing, you know, you have a lot of options when you're customizing these homes, but shower tub combo here. We're gonna walk out of there. We got two bedrooms here on, on this end. This will be our first. Got the six over six windows in throughout this house. Yeah, I'm a big fan of that second level. Like, you're gonna see this one, you're gonna see that uh, it's some cool stuff. I'm not gonna get all into it right now, but uh, basically you got a lot of options. And, you know, it just seems like maybe if you have a smaller home like this, uh, I keep calling it small, it's not really that small. I'm just saying for, for a two-story house. I guess what I'm trying to say is, y'all, that, you know, you've got that upstairs, like if you need kind of a, uh, uh, like a, a different game room. You can send the kids up there, you know, or, or you can have something up there, maybe an office. Like if you, if you need some quiet time, if you need to get away, you, you still got it, even in this size of a home. I wanna make sure that I show y'all the trim around these windows. That, it, come on. Get. I, I know the light's not that great, but that's something that, that's like going the extra mile. Okay, so we come out of there. We're gonna head back into here. This is my first time in West Virginia, I can say. I'm staying in Morgantown, which is uh, the Mountaineers, pretty sure is what I've been seeing. Okay, now here's what I wanna show you. There's our main bedroom right here to the right. We're gonna check that out, but I wanna pull this across. Look at this. This comes into the utility room. Plus we have this side door over here. We have this storage closet is the first thing we see. Got you some nice cubbies here. Some people call them lockers. Uh, I like to see that we have this window. This was nice. And then as we come on back. Oh, there's a sink. <laughs> so there's that door if you're facing the house. It's on the right side. I showed y'all that on the exterior shot. But then back here you have your spot for your washer and your dryer. It's a nice rack up top but we have the sink. We have the sink, have some countertop space in here. We've got some cabinets, got a couple drawers. Another window. Just something about that window over the sink. I mean, it's, it's almost a must, you know? Now it's time to go look at the main bedroom. Y'all come on, come with me.
full sheetrock in this house, no doubt about that. Once again, we got that really nice trim around those windows and then it kind of pushes back. I know that's not the exact professional wording on that, but you know what I mean <laughs> when, I, when I say that. Uh, got to do a little more research to figure out exactly how, what you say there. Carpet in here as well is what they went with in this show model. Here is your closet. Now, we've got one last thing. To, no, we don't. We got, still got to go upstairs. OMG. Let's go ahead and get into this uh, bath right here. Double sinks in here. That's a nice vanity. Okay, double sinks. I like this right here. And then we do a full turn, kick, two step, spin, twist. Oh, and then we show you this shower. I'm sure there's options for a tub in here. If that's something that you gotta have, keep that in mind as well. But that it but nonetheless that is a nice big walk-in shower. Okay. Now we're gonna finish this tour up with the upstairs. So as we spin back around here. Come up the stairs. Let's go. Kids, I feel like that's what I would be saying. So this upstairs is not finished out. I wanted to hold out on telling y'all that because I want y'all to drop me a comment. Let me know what you would do up here with this actual floor plan. And then with this additional space up here, what would you do? I mean, this is a lot of square footage. This would probably push it over that three. I don't know. I'm really not sure. But this is a lot of extra square footage that you would have access to do whatever you would like. I'm looking, I'm thinking probably eight foot ceilings right here across the middle. I have not measured that 100% to be for sure, but just uh, looking at it, I believe that's what we got. All right, let's wrap this video up. Thank you all so much for watching. Um, it's been a I'm really thankful they let me come video their homes here. Um, there's some really, really cool ones. So y'all stay tuned to the channel for that. Don't forget to subscribe with the notification bell. If you have not, uh, don't forget to drop us a like if you have not. That helps the videos out a lot. Um, and then lastly, if you maybe know somebody in the area, maybe you know somebody that would like to see this home, be sure to share it with them. Thank you. Okay, let's get into the outro of this video. I did want to mention I'm actually shooting this in a different spot because I don't know, uh, maybe I've got it figured out by the time this one comes out, but I mentioned a while back I got a new computer and I'm having a lot of issues with the editing. It seems like the videos um, in the out outro section are like not very clear. I don't know. I wanted to put that out there in case maybe you do know a lot about video editing. I would love for you to reach out to me. Instagram is probably the best way. I use Adobe Premiere, but some reason since I got the new computer and I use the same camera and everything, it's just something's not, I don't know. I haven't figured it out. But I have been doing some traveling, got some really cool tours. Uh, one of them, actually, I had mentioned I was going to do Airbnb property and I did it. And it's going to be next level. Like I'm hoping to be able to have that ready to put out next week. Um, it's something special. Let me just mention that it's pretty high up. Maybe that'll kind of build your curiosity. In the description below, we'll have more information on this home that we just toured. Also, one of the greatest things that we have in the description is our website link. The website is for those of you that are watching the tours and maybe you're looking to purchase something like this or maybe you want some uh, financing for yourself to see if you can get some finance. Maybe you want some exact pricing to give you some rough estimates, uh, but maybe you want some exact pricing for you and all that on this home. Use our website link in the description below. Before I go over pricing on this home, let me say 
Tuesday night's video, which will be the one before this one, just has not performed like I was hoping. I thought y'all were gonna love that because it's like so many house tours in one video. And it seems the people that have watched it loved it. However, it's not getting a very high click-through rate, which means a lot of y'all are not clicking on it. I really wanna encourage you to go back and watch that video. I think you will really enjoy it if you do end up watching it. Just wanna put that out there. If you have not seen it, it's the video before this one, which is all of my favorite tours of 2021. Now let's get into some pricing on this home. The pricing that I'm going to provide here is uh, you know, pricing that's just been provided to me. It'll be a starting price on this home with a house like that, with that second level, a lot of stuff you can do. So there's always other options, stuff you had to figure, depending on where you're putting this home, county regulations, stuff like that. Uh, and then lastly, freight charges. Freight charges can be a big thing because it has to be transported down the road. But with that being said, right here up above us, will give you a really good idea wait, where, what you can get this home for. Now I'm going to head on out of here, but I'm going to catch you on the video right before this one. Go check it out. Seriously, if you have not, it's a great, it's a great watch. Hope everyone will have a blessed day. The videos come out Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, 645 Central Time. Until Saturday night, y'all stay safe, and I will see you all then. See ya.